Hi there, this is Ed, and in our last tutorial, we went over creating this interactive Flash map in Flash Catalyst and uh, Adobe Illustrator, and exported it to an SWF uh, using Flash Catalyst uh, to get it ready to load up onto a website. And so in this uh, version, we're going to go over embedding it on a Joomla-based website. So I'm going to come over here, and, and I've got a just a basic Joomla uh, this is 2.5.6 install. Um, I have actually done this same thing on a 1.5 install. So uh, if you're using an older version of Joomla and you want to embed a flash map, uh, you can do that as well. So the first thing that we're going to have to do is to uh, go over and log into the administrative area of the website. And once we're in, you can see the uh, port the uh, control panel right here and we're going to have to do a couple things to make sure that we're going to be able to upload our SWF file to the uh, website so that we can embed it in an article. The first thing I'm going to want to do is uh, come over here to the main, uh, excuse me, not the menu manager. The first thing I'm going to want to do is go into the media manager and I want to look at my options and ensure that SWF is a legal file extension. Um, then I'm going to verify that that is and I'm going to close that. And the next thing that I want to do is go into the plugins menu and I'm going to change the uh, the content editor option to uh, from advanced to extended and I'm going to save and close that. Now when you're doing this, this is assuming that you're using the uh, Tiny Mice content editor um, to verify whether you're doing that or not. You can simply go to uh, your user manager and pull up the user profile and you can uh, determine what editor that you want to use and I'm going to select uh, Tiny Mice here. So I'm going to come back to uh, the control panel. Close that out. And I'm going to go into my media manager and upload the SWF file. So I'm going to just browse for, uh, for my interactive map. And now I have uh, several different options here. I've got the deploy to web uh, files and I also have the run local files. And the run local file SWF is the one that I want to use because everything is packaged uh, together into that SWF. So I'm going to select that and upload it to the media manager in Joomla. And you'll see I've got it right here. The next thing we want to do is find an article or a create an article that we want to embed the uh, the map in and I'm just gonna pick this uh, beginning article right here so I'm gonna just go find it in the uh, sample uh, data on this uh, Joomla install and here's the article so I'm gonna come down here and I wanna put this map right in between these two paragraphs so um, we selected the tiny mice extended so now that we uh, so we have access to this embed media uh, icon right here so I'm going to select that and that's what I'm going to use to put my flash uh, menu in so I'm just going to type uh, images I've got it already saved in here slash main let me just verify that that's the one that I want uh, it's a capital main and uh, it's gonna go ahead and try to size the dimensions automatically I've got a little bit of the bottom cut off there so I'm gonna size the bottom up to 300 and the top will automatically size to 400 or the width will automatically size to 400 so there you can see I've got the full interactive map uh, pulling up and I'm gonna hit insert and we'll put that right in the middle of the article I'm just gonna center that just so that it looks the way that I want it to and come up here and apply my change and go back to the Joomla article refresh my screen and there I have my interactive map embedded on my Joomla website so uh, hope that helps you uh, if you need to try to do a similar project um, and uh, 
Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you did, please drop by my blog at www.edhart.me. Uh, leave me a comment, and I would love certainly love to see what uh, what how you might have used this uh, functionality in your own uh, in your own work. Thanks for listening.